application for the sake of education. The partnership between the Lagos State Government and NECA ITF is informed on the need to curb unemployment by training youths to be qualified, competent and skilled individuals for the building industry. 90 graduates who have completed a three years training program in construction trades under the Technical Skills Development Program are presented with certificates. <laughs> 75 of the graduates from plumbing, carpentry, and block laying and tiling already have 25 incorporated business entities. The government says this initiative reinforces its efforts on value addition to improve skills training and entrepreneurship development of youths in the built industry. The technical skills and entrepreneurial training of the 90 students is a novel approach the Labour State Government wishes to stretch to its fullness. This administration has decided to pay more attention to reforming our technical colleges with the infusion of entrepreneurship education for a self-reliant Lagos economy. This administration will therefore continue to encourage private partnership in order to frontally address the problem of unemployment, which is a core social challenge in the state. These new micro enterprises will now be the new phase of providing quality service in our residential estates in Lagos area. At this point of huge youth unemployment, Lagos State came up with innovative solutions that has transformed some of the economy of the state. The need therefore to engage the private sector in making more investments in the youth, using technical and vocational education as a tool to inspire the youth to achieve their full potentials. The initiative, which is believed to have stimulated self-employment, is to continue to position Lagos youths to appreciate the immense opportunities in the building and construction sector.